Hello, Marguerite here with an overview of collage art assignments, what they are and how to how to do them. Um, what they are are assignments to help you create collage art. And these can be good if you're new to collage art and don't really know what what to do, how to do it. This gives you a really narrow scope of things that you uh, can gather as pieces of paper that you use to create collages. And the other thing it's good for is if you don't have a lot of time and you want to do something creative, uh, this is a good way to focus on the things that um, things that you can easily find and create a collage out of. So what they are are five prompts plus the bonus. And the bonus is here in case you look through these five and you say, oh, I, I don't have anything shiny. I can't find anything shiny that's flat, a piece of paper. So instead, cross that off and you're going to use instead the bonus, which in this case is a window or a door. In addition to these uh, prompts, you can grab some pattern paper and an embellishment. These are things to help you um, add something at the end if you feel that your collage just needs something, it needs something else. Um, you can add a sticker or a postage stamp or something small um, to help round out or to finish your collage. And I'll talk more about that in a bit. So depending on your substrate, for example, if you have a little small notebook like like this and you're going to be collaging on here, maybe your five um, prompts is, an, is enough for your collage. You can, or you can also add your pattern paper to make it, you know, start, start with a piece of pattern paper and then add your, the rest of your pieces on your collage. I am using this larger journal, notebook, whatever, book. And I'm collaging right on top of the old pages, so I definitely need a piece of pattern paper over to cover some or all of this text. I actually found this piece of paper that someone had sent to me, so I think I'm just going to do that right here. And I like how I've got some of the green overlapping or behind so that it comes, it comes through. So I have my things. A piece of postcard either side. I'm not sure yet which side I want to use. Something that represents time. This is a very simple um, interpretation which is a, a watch. Something shiny turned out to be my label, wine label. I like to pull labels off of wine bottles. Um, the way you do that, if you're interested, is to boil hot water, pour it into your empty wine um, bottle, wait about five minutes, and then start to peel off the edge. This works about 80% uh, of the time, sometimes, depending on the glue that's on the back of the sticker, it comes off and sometimes it doesn't. So if after 10 minutes it's not budging, then uh, forget it. It's not going to come off, likely. All right, so that's something shiny. Something in the shape of a triangle are these postage stamps. Depending on how my collage turns out, I will choose one of these. Something used in an office, that's, you know, all up to interpretation. I found this the piece of washi tape that had some office supplies, and I thought, well, maybe I'll, I'll tear that out. Um, but then I remembered that a stapler is found in an office, and I have a few little scraps left on my desk from another project. So if I staple it, this is this now works as something that can be found in an office. So all of these things are up for interpretation. Whatever you can come up with is your interpretation of 
what these prompts are. There is no wrong answer, basically. If you can justify any, you know, any anything like I did with this, it's it's good enough for your collage. All right, so then I just choose how I want to lay this down. I'm probably going to do something like this. Or maybe over the top, I'm not sure. Maybe cut that down. And since I have blue here, let's go with a blue triangle. Okay, so I'm going to play with these, create something, and be right back. All right, so I'm done. This is what I've come up with. This is my collage of five prompts. I used two po uh, postage stamps here just because they were from the same series and I thought that they looked good. I also used a little bit of rubber stamping on here just to decorate it a little bit. So now that this is done, the, the assignment is complete. I've, I've made a collage out of my five prompts. You look over your collage and decide, is there something else that you want to add? Here, if you notice, there's this kind of spot that's empty. So I think I will add something. I found this... Um, it's just a little image of a violin with some flowers that are blue that would match the color of this stamp. So I'm going to just glue that. Glue that right in there. And that will be that. So that is an overview of the assignment. I hope that you found this useful and that it encourages you to do more of them. Thanks for watching.